Do y'all see the way this girl, Erica, 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 do y'all see the way she look? I'm about to tell y'all why she looking like that right now. Y'all ready to talk about it? Let's juice. Come on, Blazer. It's a beat for me. I almost gave up on a power that I can't explain. Fell from heaven like a shower now. Girl, the people had said Erica got fired again, girl. I know y'all. Listen, Linda's and listen, Linda's. I'm just telling you what they said. The people said Erica, Erica got fired again. Now, let me just say this. I had went to bed last night and I said my prayers and I woke up and I thanked the most high for, you know, waking me up and all of that. And I did not know he was going to bestow another blessing on to me. I didn't know that. I didn't know. I, I, you know, every day is a blessing. Let's start there first. But I didn't know that I was going to be blessed in abundance. And, you know, it's not just a blessing for me, y'all. It's a blessing for y'all, too. Because y'all remember, Erica Mina had um, called Spice, regular Spice, original Spice, a black blue monkey. Now, if you haven't seen my Love and Hip Hop Atlanta reviews, please go watch them. People say they funny. You know what I'm saying? I'm just telling you what they say. They say it's funny. But in my reviews, I talk about this all the time. Like, her constant disrespect of black people and then eating off of us and i was like in my last review or the one where i say she got fired or temporarily fired from loving hip-hop atlanta i said well i think all the black networks that she's eating from needs to follow suit and it sure as i got a nose on my face bitch check this out now remember i had said in my last video i said she's working on this new set in the uh video clip or in the reality show yeah she was getting ready to go in on this uh show that she's working on on the all black network and that's just me just speaking but you know they say words have power that's what they said i said just speaking i said the all black network need to pull they um support back too and they show us shit they did they said according to i think i want to say as earlier as last night they put up a statement and they say erica is fired indefinitely bitch not like loving hip-hop atlanta and mona sky playing in our face indefinitely look what they had said they said we do not condone erica mina's recent reprehensible comment she will be featured in the upcoming season of hush set to premiere later this year as production was completed months ago but in the event of additional seasons she will not be a part of the cast and that's from the all black people at the hush people now let me just say this y'all first and foremost i know them people done already rap production they done already paid for the tapes so that's gonna come out so we gotta take that l we gotta take that lick because the people already paid for that they just won't get their money back you know what i'm saying and i understand that but they saying moving forward, she will not be a part of the cast at all. And you know, this is a this is good. This is great, actually. And I remember seeing people like, oh, y'all think y'all gotta win, but it's just a season. It's just a season. I don't give a damn if they suspended the bitch for an hour. As long as she was reprimanded, that's the point. Black women will be respected. And we will respect ourselves too, which is why I drag your Suki Hanas, which is why I drag your Glorillas, which is why I drag your Sexy Reds, because we will respect ourselves and we will be respected, especially amongst the clear reptilians who like to come into our culture and cosplay, eat off of us, take the black peen, which I don't care, take it, girl. If they're going to give it to your girl, get it, because them niggas is treasonous anyway. But do all of that, hang with black people, eat profit and do all of that off of black people and then turn around and call us a monkey and this the gag and it's not even really a gag the bitch got two two half black kids because they're not black let's start there first she got two half black kids and she felt the need in an argument no matter what spice said to just go to a racial slur it is what it is shout out to the all black people the hush people at the all black i don't watch none of that shit i ain't gonna lie i don't i don't really do the tubi like you know stuff i don't i just don't I, and i'm not saying it's tubi stuff i don't know what it is i just don't watch it but look shout out to the people down there who saw this and said hell no 
we not gonna uh do a Mona Scott and play in y'all face and say, oh, we just gonna take her off the following season. No, they say she will no longer be a part of the cast. Now, Erica, Erica, you home wrecking whore. You are getting everything you deserve. All your karma is coming in abundance. You slept with DJ Envy with his beige ass, even though I don't feel bad for DJ Envy because he a bitch ass, you know, beige nigga, you know. But you slept with that man while he had a um, wife, allegedly, they say it. And then you was with him for a long time, they say it. Then when you got Safari, you thought you was going to get treated like a wife and he treated you like uh, what Blueface called uh, Krishan a bop because that's what you is. And then he left you... He left you for dead, babe. And then after that, now you on there crying, losing weight, and you're looking like this. You know, the most high sit high, but he also looks slow. There's a reason that nigga drained you out, bitch, girl. You look like a skeletor, bitch. You look like, girl, I, I don't even want to say what I want to say because I ain't trying to get, you know what I'm saying? But, girl, you look bad. You look so bad, babe. And I know you're probably about to start looking like that again because now your man done left you and your jobs is leaving you as they should, as both of them should, because you're getting your karma. It's funny that a girl can go from this. Like y'all remember when Erica, Erica used to look like this. That's when she was young and vibrant and drop kicking her baby daddy up in the New York streets. Yeah, did see it. Did see the video. Uh, I'm a, matter of fact, I'm going to link it in this video too so y'all can see it. I just don't want to put it up there because YouTube don't let black people do what they let the other people do. But look, this is her then. And this is what you... That bitch done aged about 45 years in a span of five, girl. Let me tell y'all something. She got everything she deserves. Shout out to the all black people at the Hush people. Y'all did justice, actual justice. And let this be a lesson to the other clear bitches who want to be amongst us and act like they better than us. And then it's on Mad Day, use racial slurs when they feel some type of way because they niggas want to come back home to the melanin. Oh, fat. Go ahead on spray paint yourself again. Just don't take a picture, bitch, because if I see it, I'm going to drag you. Anyway, that's all I got, y'all. Erica got fired for real, for real this time. And she got fired again. Y'all drop down in the comments and let me know what y'all thought about this, girl. I think it is wonderful. The grace of God has been among us. Black women, let this, hey, this is a win. This is a win. I don't, and I don't care what no niggas say. This right here is a win. We will be respected. Bam. Y'all drop down in the comments. Let me know what y'all thought. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Follow me on all platforms, okay? And I'll see y'all later. Bye. Mr. Carroll. How you give the voodoo dog time to talk? I don't get no fucking time to talk. Who the voodoo dog is? The nigga you just had up here.